Welcome to Tuk Tuk Restaurant and Bar at Milton. My name is Mutita p o t o n g and this is my story. We serve modern Thai food, and we want customer feel like they are in Thailand. Follow me, and this is the garden. How can we make the tuk tuk to feel like Thai? And we decided to have the tuk tuk to the bar. We fly back to Thailand to bring it to Australia. It's very popular for people. When people came here and saw the tuk tuk name and the real tuk tuk, they try to drive, but mm, they cannot. <laughs> I grew up in a small farming village in northeastern Thailand, and my family we own a small grocery shop and rice and sugarcane farm. When I was six years old, I started to help mom cut veggie, preparing and help her. Just learn by do it. And the uh, carrot. Thai food in Australia more like Thai food in Bangkok. But different from where I live, we made the food spicier and more strong taste. In my hometown, we add pickle fish. The smell quite strong. Once you try it, you cannot stop eating it. <laughs> oh, love it! <laughs> but I used to work in the financial, but I feel like I don't like that job. My sister, she owned this restaurant with her husband in 2012, and she want me to come and help her run the business. And I came here and help her. I feel like I come home. <laughs> Sometimes I feel upset, and I call my mom, and she said, "Don't give up, keep going. Once you learn, it's easier. After that, every time when I have a problem and I call her, I I have more confidence." Hello, what is up? Hello, man. My name is Mahesh. Now, Kinder. Hello. สินเฮดานแกงไก่ที่แม่เคยให้กินตอนอยู่บ้านตอนเป็นเด็กหน่อยจำได้ปะกินไก่อยากให้แม่บ้านมาหาอยู่ออสเตรเลียเด้อชินฮอดอยากให้มากินข้าวน้ำกันยูรานอีกอยากให้นักกินสู้กิน Last year her sick and stay in the hospital we have the video video call And I saw her very skinny, and that's why it make me really miss her a lot. Because I, when her sick, I can't look after her. One day, I dream about my sister. She called me. Would you like to buy the r e s t a u r a n t for me? I said yes, but I don't have money. But she said it's okay, and I'm very happy in my dream. <laughs> After that, my sister called me on Friday, and she asked me, "Hi, Mo, how are you?" I said, "I'm good." How the rest long? <laughs> I said, wait. And you gonna ask me to buy the rest long? 
I said, yes, I want you to buy the restaurant for me. Oh, really? It's like in my dream. And I said, and I tell her, like, I don't have money. And she said, it's okay. You can pay me when you have. And now I own the restaurant. Because <laughs> my parents always work hard, but they never ask for money for me or my sister. They just keep your money. We be happy. Till now, I still save up money, and I want my parents not to work hard. Now I, I can support them. I want them to be more happier. Miss you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Miss you too.